Hello everybody, let's get the caves out of the way. Oh yeah, and welcome back to Let's Play Turok 2 by the Real Troid. This is I guess part 68. And the caves, despite being a very long and tedious level, is the quickest one to get the Premagen key in because I believe... Oh, oh, almost fell down. Yeah, we need to go down here. Uh, I believe everything new that can be accessed with new talismans is right here. And this guy... Oh no, he's not clever, he's just forgot about me and went about his patrol route. Oh well. No going invisible will not help you, because it does not shut down your brain waves or something. Whatever these boars are homing into, I think it's brain waves. Mm -hmm, one more. Mm, anybody up here? Oh shit, a blind one. Oh great, thanks for this. I cannot do anything while I'm flying, but take damage. So fuck you, motherfucker. It's a shame I didn't see his new gore animation. Well, maybe not new, but it looked kind of cool. All the three seconds that he was flying around. Okay, this is probably for getting up there, but I don't think I will need it. And this is kind of a new area. I hear blind ones. Suppose they're down there. Let's go around and see what we can get here first. I honestly don't remember this place at all. I wonder if it was like changed for the PC version or my memory is just that bad. Because I don't remember there being any like new castles and holes down in new areas like this when I played this. But then again I did it only like one time so... And I was never claiming that my memory is very good. Oh, that was very nice. Uh, some rockets here, let's try and land on them, maybe. Oh fuck. Oh well. I guess I can always use some respawning place. Once again there is a lock for a key. There is one more guy here and uh, I guess yeah, he's summoning the worms. Lots of worms in this game. Like these guys, then the guys in the blind one boss, then the guys that stick out from mud in level 3 and from ground in this level. All kinds of crazy bug shit. I like it because crazy bug shit make for uh, interesting enemies, at least for me. But I, I am aware that my tastes in FPS is sometimes are not very similar to popular tastes like jumping puzzles and shit like that because nobody seems to like them for some reason I can't imagine why uh, how would I like to get up there and take those three rockets but I guess no such luck I don't care enough to return here after I supposedly get back up there Did I ever use a Scorpion Missile Launcher on the giant spiders? Let's see how it works. Well, it blows the shit out of the small spiders, that's for sure. And... Uh, okay, I have one ammo left. Let's waste some... Whoa, it actually killed him pretty fast. And uh, thank you for auto-selecting the flamethrower, because it is also a very good weapon against the spiders. Uh, Okay, Ultra Health, anything else? Portal, where it leads. Alright, to the Premagen Key. Okay, we already have it, and we are going to go back to the entrance portal, actually. Of course, I could, you know, take all the level, go through the level once again, and go through the exit portal, but Yes, I'm not doing that. This is going to be a short video because I just return and that's it. But we got this out of the way and the next level, the hive, I don't remember at all where the extra stuff is in there. In this one I at least remember that uh, place in which we, where we used the wind talisman or how was it called, spirit 
gust or something like that. But in the hive I have no idea where in, in the level later or earlier is the secret stuff. Well, I suppose it's not secret, but the new stuff. So... This time I will probably have to actually play ahead and see for myself before recording. So, goodbye until the next time, the next part of Turok 2.